Hello beautiful people, I'm so happy to see you back on my channel, it's me Christine with you and let's get started. So I made a video about my bag collection which was not, like nothing is really like crazy and big about my collections, it's kind of maybe more than average person has and I'm all thankful for what I have. I just want to share with you and maybe help you somehow give you some ideas. I know that I love to watch collections. I love to watch collections and hauls. And I want to give you something what I love to watch basically. Yeah. And today I decided to make the same about shoes. But I do have like a lot of shoes, all kind of shoes all around. So it's now to show you all of them. It will be crazy, like that video will be like one hour long. Okay, I will make summer shoe favorite because that will not be like shoe collection because I don't so show you all my collection, but they are like my favorite shoes. My kind of addiction. Let's get started. Is our kind of summer shoes, but also kind of winter shoes. Like I think you can use it for everywhere. Like. All the special occasions and wedding, for example, or Christmas party, you can wear them. And these are these Michael Kors high heels. I bought them in Latvia. Mm -hmm. And yeah, they were like 50 euros in like an outlet store. And I really, really, really love them. I have worn them a few times. And they were around Christmas, like these occasions. I wore them around Christmas time. And I really like them. They're not the most comfortable shoes, obviously, because you see how big the high heel is. But they are not also the worst. Like, they are really good, nice shoes. Then, I'm really loving, like, to be honest, I understood that I have most of my shoes from that outlet in Latvia. They have amazing shoes for nice price, good quality, great brands. It's just amazing. And I really miss that outlet, to be honest. If I something goes to Latvia and I have like money or something, I will definitely go there and see what they so got. So these are from Pe Peter Kaiser. I don't remember all the prices. But they, well, they, that was all like obviously, so it was cheaper than normally. Usually the these shoes were like 30 to 50. It's usually the price of which I like buy the shoes. Sometimes it's like 15, but usually it's something around that price point. And I love them because they were like, they are nude high heels which look stylish and you can wear them on to the work, to like some event, like some blogger event, whatever party. And yeah, and I love that interesting uh, heel they have. Material, really, really, really soft and they are really comfortable, like so, so, so great. I love Peter Kaiser. I just follow him on Instagram and I'm watching all the like the new shoes they come out with and they are so beautiful <sighs> the next shoes i have are really really summery they remind me of summer and they are kind of feels like classy summer shoes and like wedding shoes i would love to own these in all the colors possible like black and nude color these are these tamari shoes I have seen a lot of girls wear these. I don't know if it's really Tamaris or that's something really similar. But I have seen like on Instagram actually girls having these. And they are really pretty. And I even like remember once I wore it to the work. Like I wanted to really, I don't know, wear like dress up and be pretty. And the saddest part are that they actually feel like wearing like a slipper. But there was something around here, I think, this part, which was not like... I don't remember now. There was something about my ankle or so that it just was rubbing like against it, you know, and, and creating blister. And that was... Uh, or this, I think, here. And that's sad, because if usually the first thing which happens to me is that the shoe is just like... The high heel is just too high or just like it does not fit with my food so good but this actually felt like a slipper except that part so that's why I was I have been scared to wear it ever since and thought I want to try it so I don't know maybe I I will try someday when I know I will not walk like a lot it's 
maybe to someone's door or so on. So let's see how that works out. But then the next shoes are the ones which I bought them as this natural kind of daily shoes when you want to like a bit dress up with like jeans or so. And I have not had really opportunity to wear them because this part for my shoe is like too high or so. It just goes like it breaks my feet like this and it does not feel really good and it makes me so sad. Like so sad. You have no idea. I think I even tried to wear it around the office. I think I did once and it didn't even work there. So if you cannot even wear it on the on the carpet around office then like that's a sign. <laughs> and these are from the brand name Zing. Zing. I don't know can read it now you cannot they are made in Spain how ironic because I bought them a few years ago again in that outlet and uh, I did not know that they were in Spain I had no I never visited Spain at that time and I did not have a Spanish boyfriend at that time and I did not know I will have one <gasps> oh my god I just took my shoes. Oh my god. How and when it. Oh my god. I wanted to say, like, continuing with nude shoes. I have these, and I have shown you on my Instagram as well. These are the latest purchase, I think. Um, and these are super comfortable. They have, like, this super cute heel. And I have worn them twice already, which is a lot since I don't really go out as much. Um, I use them for my both like blogger kind of events I had. But what I just noticed stuck in my feet and I'm in my soul, not feet. But I'm happy that it is not in my feet because it could be. Look at that, that's like a metallic piece. I just noticed that, imagine if it was like stuck through that, look how it stayed, oh my god. Like I know people who have had like all kind of crazy stuff like in their feet, like I'll like step on the metals and stuff like that and that's like, oh that's like awful and crazy and I don't even know how, where to put this metal <laughs> so it doesn't hurt anyone. So, like oh my last purchase, I just, my mom bought me in here in Spain in like small cute store they had like all kind of cute modern designs for like low prices like a normal brand not like low low like they were like 30 euros I think if I don't get wrong I don't remember but yeah and in all kind of colors I really love and there's like one like many designs and each design has like a lot of color options I really like when they have that but yeah, super, super, super comfortable shoes. This is one of the shoes I'm sure I will cry when it breaks and everything because it's like, it's not easy to find such a nice heels. The next one I bought in Latvia, in online store actually. Yeah, before coming to Spain, I want some cute shoes. Like, I really wanted some cute shoes when I come to Spain. Like, I didn't have, like, I did not do like li last years to be honest I did not do a lot of shopping in Latvia they actually are really good the only thing is this part it asks for some platform so it will be easier because when you be when I walk too much in them like around the city my feet and this part of the feet it just it's like too hard you know and when it presses down too much it's like hurts kind of so yeah but any but other than that i love the heel really with this gold and details and everything i used to not like gold at all like nothing jewelry nothing like like not so much in last years i just love gold and details i think it looks really luxurious and the shoe looks really really luxurious as well they had discounts again i don't remember how much it was i think it was 15 or 20, really, really loving these ones. These are like a, you know, kill someone if you, no violence. Then I have this gifted guest 
right? And like the sole is like really chunky and it doesn't really like, it's not flexible. So I have a feeling they might not be the most comfortable shoes. So I want to like test them out first before I really wear them somewhere. But they are from Guess. These are the shoes I would never buy or pick up myself. Yeah, but I when I got them, I was like happy because again, gold. And I thought with jeans and that, it just gives like, just gives that pop of an accent. Yeah, I think these are. Oh, these are made in Spain. What a coincidence. Made in Spain. I did not know that Guess like makes in Spain as well. Hmm, interesting. Also, my boyfriend bought them. To me, it's just supermarket, basically basic thing. But in supermarket, sometimes you can find the cutest stuff. And these are that thing which I will not like want to spend 30 euros on these. These are just nice, cute red. Uh, and I love this kind of red. It's like raspberry red. Like slippers. How do you call these? These are slippers or how can I? I know in Latin how you call them. But yeah, and they are so, so cute and they are so comfortable and Again, just give some nice pop of accent. It already thought has like it's like a bit dirty here, so the same saying five euros. Perfect. Then guys, I have one wedges, which are like these, which I will mention you now, are mostly like not really brand ones, except ones. But yeah, most of these are not like sandals and those stuff. I usually don't buy really branded one, even though it's weird. But I don't know, I just. I don't know why. It's really difficult to explain why. Maybe I don't see them so much like in the stores, which like has like normal kind of pricing because I can't afford like 100 euros shoes. So yeah, but these are the wedges which has story because like one month ago in May, I needed to go seven kilometers from here to one event and I needed to dress nice as well. So I thought what nice I could wear which I could actually walk in possibly seven kilometers. So I cho chose this one. I don't have any other wedges, at least here. And they did the job. I walked those seven kilometers. I did not die, but still, you know, they still have a platform. The road still was a road and it still hurt my feet at the end. But I think they still are one of the best in the being comfortable because seven, seven kilometers I cannot imagine to walk in even the slippers I showed you and all and even those guests like shoes and everything I think they would not be so comfortable so cookies for that and then I will show you these ones which are my Converse and I bought them in Spain last year when I was not living here still like before that they are really cute sometimes they like rubbing here and can make some blister I need to be really careful what kind of socks I'm wearing so I'm really careful about that but other than that they are really nice and really cute and yeah my dreams finally came true I really wanted some Converse and I think Spain is a country where you kind of at least somehow can wear converse like i have worn them a lot and okay they are not like brand new white you can see that but they are still white in latvia i could not imagine that you get unlucky one day with like a rain or something and they will be all ruined most likely so and then the last i want to just show you my not branded random sandals which are my favorite sandals so these are my kind of favorite sandals, they look like this, I love that they have like this kind of snake texture here and I love that it has a big bigger sole because I hate it nowadays. Most of these like sandal type of shoes, summer shoes, they have like nothing, they are so slippery you can fall down like even not walking like just standing and they have sole like this like not even one centimeter like doesn't anyone think about souls and health and everything like that's crazy like it's just not healthy to wear these so that's why it, like I love these shoes which I just bought in Latvia in some chain store I think which has like really cute and all kind of designs uh, and like normal price and I think we are over it's a really difficult thing because I have shoes like all over like this room there everything so I just hope this video will not turn out too long and I hope you enjoy it at some level 
and uh, yeah and i hope you really like it and let me know what kind of brand or stories you go to when you go shopping for shoes i'm really curious about that and give it a thumbs up and subscribe and ring that bell to get notifications for my new videos and guys bye